Hello guys, it's JC4, here we are back with Jet Force Gemini, and here we landed on Taffert as Juno. But, although you see those guys roaming about, they're actually nothing to fear. Like, I know you see all this, but I mean, you can't really do much about it. Now, you can get all the tribals technically on your first run, but it's a little bit weird. So right now I'm just going to kind of run through this without grabbing any, and then I'm going to come back in the same part, and it's, I don't know, it's going to be real weird, but you're going to see how it works out. It's going to be like, you go to Area 2 to grab something, then you go back to Area 1, but since it's so far into Area 2, I'm just not going to actually show anything in this video, but in Area 2, then I'll show you, like, okay, here's where I get, did this to do that to get this, alright? It'll make sense, I hope, but, uh, here we are at the end already. Did you know what have I done? Last remaining tribal colonies. Misuse my powers, help Miser, what do you it's wanted? Uh, what a nightmare. It looks like Mizar's bathroom. Well, first let's demand a weapon. It's a real cool weapon, one of the most powerful in the game, the Tri Rocket Launcher. You'll see that when uh, I get my chance to use it. Now, Taffrit, as you see right here, was once a lot like Goldwood. Now, of course, you're wondering what the hell happened to Taffrit to make it turn into this land of the dead. As you see, there's King Jeff right there. So he created these zombies, and then killed the planet. Nice. <laughs> like I'm only like three minutes into it and we're already like done. Okay, now, what you need to do though, is we're basically done with the area. This is it. But, like I said, I'm gonna cut away. So, I'm gonna meet you right back here with a weapon called the, well, an item called the crowbar. I'll show you guys how to get it, and it all makes sense in whenever. But till then, I'm gonna cut away, so I'll see you guys in the future. Okay, I'm back now with a crowbar. Now, what the crowbar does is it opens doors like this. The reason I didn't want to show me getting the crowbar is because it's basically at the end of the next area. So, it... I just didn't feel like doing it because of that. Felt like it'd be a waste. Now, down here is the tombs. Now, what you need to do is you need to open each and every one of these... Damn it. And then kill all these guys. Yeah, you see it turned on rainbow blood. And save whichever tribals are in here. That's not a tribal, that's a zombie. So, blast them to hell. Let's move on to this one. Anyone in here or is it a tribal? Good, see? And you can't get down here without the crowbar, so only Juno can do this. But again, you know, this is still technically your first visit, so it's like you can, but you can't do it. It's weird. Oh, hi, baby bop. I'm gonna shot you there. Just because we can, let's use the tri-rockets. Yeah, tri-rockets are immensely useful. But you can't stand too close when they're being fired because, as common sense would imply, they would hurt you. But I'm a fearless bastard, so why do I care? 
Now, when it came to me running down and um, getting the crowbar, I didn't grab anything except, by accident, one pistol upgrade. I'll show where that is. I only grabbed it accidentally because it was where I thought health was, but I just kind of jumped up and grabbed it, and I was like, ah, oh, damn it. So, that's all that's down here, so we can leave. But yeah, you see why I decided I had to get the crowbar, because, you know, more than half your tribals are down here. Half of them, technically. Okay, four tri-rockets. Plus, over here in the cemetery, you'll see there's little doors on these tombs. You can blast them open with the tri-rockets or homing missiles. There's two more of our tribals. Just open up this one, it looks like. I see it's open. Aha, a weapon. And in here is... The grenades. Grenades can be useful, but I've never really found an astounding use for them. I mean, at one point you're kind of forced to use them. You'll see that soon, but uh, I just never really found them overly useful, so I don't tend to use them much, so... Where is it? There's a capacity behind this tombstone right here. There you go. Now then, we've gotten all these. This should be backwards. I need full tri rocket ammo. Let me grab that real quick. <laughs> I know, aren't I just thinking ahead? Alright, now let's go. Now we've gotten everything. The best way to kill these zombies, though, as you've seen, is either explosives or the plasma shotgun. If you're going to use the plasma shotgun, you have to soften them up with a bit of machine gun, though. There, boom. That was better than I was anticipating. I was expecting him to live, but already then, I'm not complaining. Let's run about. And there's another one. So let's shoot him down. I missed. Shit. There we go. That's what I like about this game, is they have a tri-rocket launcher. That's pretty badass. But of course, I remember when I was little, my best friend Sven told me that Gold and I had a quad rocket launcher. And for some reason, I believed him. Of course, after getting Gold and I, I realized he was fucking lying to me. This is the same guy that also told me that they were making a fourth Aladdin with Jafar's brother. Oh, I don't know why I listened to him on such things, but I did. Now behind this life force door is our remaining two tribals. So, just run right here and grab them. There shouldn't be anything else for you in here, but I guess I'll check anyway. I don't recall there being anything, at least. Except for these blokes, but, you know, who cares about them? And yeah, as far as blood goes, it's just sta- Ah, here's something we missed. Health upgrade. There we go. There, that's advising. As far as standard blood goes, it's usually just, like, black is for the flying robots, green is gonna be for anything else, and then red is just tribals. It's that simple. That's why I turned on rainbow. That because I felt like showing it off. So, there you go. Everyone's happy. Except for that guy, because he's never happy. Who was I pointing to? You don't know. Primarily because I wasn't pointing, so... Let's just hurry up and finish this area. God damn it. I'm nine minutes in. I guess that'll be a good place to call it quits then. So... This is JC4R. It's been Jet Force Gemini Part, I believe, 5. So I'll see you guys later as we go further into Taffert with Juno.